Miami Marlins' Miguel Rojas, right, hits a three-run home run as Los Angeles Dodgers starting pitcher Clayton Kershaw, left, and catcher Yasmani Grandel watched during the fifth inning of a baseball game Wednesday, April 25, 2018, in Los Angeles. AP Photo, Mark J. Terrell, Miami Marlins starting pitcher Trevor Richards throws to the plate during the second inning of a baseball game against the Los Angeles Dodgers Wednesday, April 25, 2018, in Los Angeles. AP Photo, Mark J. Terrell, the gallery will resume in seconds Los Angeles, California, April 25, Corey Seager. Photo by Victor D. Colin Gunn, Getty Images, Miami Marlins starting pitcher Trevor Richards throws to the plate during the second inning of a baseball game against the Los Angeles Dodgers Wednesday, April 25, 2018, in Los Angeles. AP Photo, Mark J. Terrell, Los Angeles Dodgers starting pitcher Clayton Kershaw throws to the plate during the third inning of a baseball game against the Miami Marlins Wednesday, April 25, 2018, in Los Angeles. AP Photo, Mark J. Terrell, Los Angeles Dodgers starting pitcher Clayton Kershaw throws to the plate during the first inning of a baseball game against the Miami Marlins on Wednesday, April 25, 2018, in Los Angeles. AP Photo, Mark J. Terrell, Miami Marlins starting pitcher Trevor Richards throws to the plate during the second inning of a baseball game against the Los Angeles Dodgers Wednesday, April 25, 2018, in Los Angeles. AP Photo, Mark J. Terrell, Los Angeles Dodgers starting pitcher Clayton Kershaw rubs the ball after giving up a hit during the second inning of a baseball game against the Miami Marlins Wednesday, April 25, 2018, in Los Angeles. AP Photo, Mark J. Terrell, Los Angeles Dodgers starting pitcher Clayton Kershaw throws to the plate in this multiple exposure image during the second inning of a baseball game against the Miami Marlins on Wednesday, April 25, 2018, in Los Angeles. AP Photo, Mark J. Terrell, Miami Marlins' Miguel Rojas, left, hits a three-run home run as Los Angeles Dodgers catcher Yasmani Grandel watches during the fifth inning of a baseball game Wednesday, April 25, 2018, in Los Angeles. AP Photo, Mark J. Terrell, Miami Marlins' Miguel Rojas, left, hits a three-run home run as Los Angeles Dodgers starting pitcher Clayton Kershaw, the lower right, and catcher Yasmani Grandel watch during the fifth inning of a baseball game Wednesday, April 25, 2018, in Los Angeles. AP Photo, Mark J. Terrell, Miami Marlins' Miguel Rojas drops his bat as he looks toward his dugout after hitting a three-run home run during the fifth inning of a baseball game against the Los Angeles Dodgers Wednesday, April 25, 2018, in Los Angeles. P photo, Mark J. Terrell, Dodgers starting pitcher Clayton Kershaw wipes his face after giving up a three-run home run to the Marlins' Miguel Rojas during the fifth inning of Wednesday's game at Dodger Stadium. AP Photo, Mark J. Terrell, Miami Marlins' Miguel Rojas, left gestures after hitting a three-run home run as teammates Cameron Mabin, second from left, and Justin Bohr, second from right, wait at the plate along with Los Angeles Dodgers catcher Yasmani Grandel during the fifth inning of a baseball game Wednesday, April 25, 2018, in Los Angeles. AP Photo, Mark J. Terrell, Miami Marlins Miguel Rojas, second from left, is congratulated by Cameron Mabin, left, after hitting a three-run home run as Los Angeles Dodgers starting pitcher Clayton Kershaw, the lower right, and catcher Yasmani Grandel stand by during the fifth inning of a baseball game Wednesday, April 25, 2018, in Los Angeles. AP Photo, Mark J. Terrell, Miami Marlins' Miguel Rojas, right, celebrates in the dugout with Starlin Castro after hitting a three-run home run during the fifth inning of a baseball game against the Los Angeles Dodgers Wednesday, April 25, 2018, in Los Angeles. AP Photo, Mark J. Terrell, Miami Marlins' JT. Rudo, right, hits a solo home run as Los Angeles Dodgers catcher Yasmani Grandel, left, and home plate umpire Joe West watched during the sixth inning of a baseball game Wednesday, April 25, 2018, in Los Angeles. AP Photo, Mark J. Terrell, Miami Marlins JT. Ramudo, left, hits a solo home run as Los Angeles Dodgers catcher Yasmani Grandel, center, and home plate umpire Joe West watched during the sixth inning of a baseball game Wednesday, April 25, 2018, in Los Angeles. AP Photo, Mark J. Terrell, Los Angeles Dodgers' Matt Kemp, right, hits a two-run home run while Miami Marlins catcher J.T. Romudo, left, watches along with home plate umpire Joe West during the eighth inning of a baseball game Wednesday, April 25, 2018, in Los Angeles. AP Photo, Mark J. Terrell, Los Angeles Dodgers' Matt Kemp, left, runs to first as he hits a two-run home run while Miami Marlins relief pitcher Morandi Gonzalez, center, and catcher J.T. Romuto watch during the eighth inning of a baseball game Wednesday, April 25, 2018, in Los Angeles.
AP Photo, Mark J. Terrell, the Dodgers' Cody Bellinger reacts after missing on his swing for a strike in the sixth inning of Wednesday's game against the Miami Marlins at Dodger Stadium. The Marlins won 8-6. Photo by Victor D. Colin Gunn, Getty Images, the Marlins' JT. Romuto hits a two-run home run to left field in the eighth inning, his second of the game, during Wednesday's game against the Dodgers at Dodger Stadium. The Marlins won 8-6. Photo by Victor D. Colin Gunn, Getty Images, Los Angeles, California, April 25, first baseman Cody Bellinger. The Marlins defeated the Dodgers 8-6. Photo by Victor D. Colin Gunn, Getty Images, Dodgers shortstop Corey Seager falls as he tries to field a ball hit for a single by Miami Marlins J.B. During the ninth inning of a baseball game Wednesday, April 25, 2018, in Los Angeles. AP Photo, Mark J. Terrell, Los Angeles Dodgers' Yasmani Grandel gestures as he scores after hitting a two-run home run during the ninth inning of a baseball game against the Miami Marlins Wednesday, April 25, 2018, in Los Angeles. AP Photo, Mark J. Terrell, Miami Marlins relief pitcher Brad Ziegler throws to the plate during the ninth inning of a baseball game against the Los Angeles Dodgers Wednesday, April 25, 2018, in Los Angeles. AP Photo, Mark J. Terrell, Los Angeles, before this road trip with the Miami Marlins, Trevor Richards had never been west of Oklahoma. He might not have made it to Disneyland, Universal Studios or the Hollywood Walk of Fame. But he will always have great memories of his first time in California, the time he outpitched Clayton Kershaw. While Kershaw was scattering walks like a rookie, it was Richards who held the Dodgers to one hit in the first five innings, a single by Kershaw, and the Marlins held off the Dodgers, handing them an 8-6 defeat Wednesday. The Marlins came into this series with a 5.54 staff error, nearly the highest in baseball. While taking two of three from the Dodgers, though, they held them to 10 runs, half of them in the final two innings of the three-game series, and 20 hits. I think any time you lose it's frustrating, Dodgers manager Dave Roberts said. But you've got to give the Marlins credit. They outpitched us and they outdid us and they won a series. The stripped down Marlins won't do that often this season and each one will no doubt leave the opponent wondering how that happened, particularly so for the Dodgers who are separated from the Marlins by $90 million in payroll and an even greater chasm in expectations. Baseball's not like basketball or football, Dodgers first baseman Cody Bellinger said. The better team doesn't always win. The Marlins' starting pitchers in this series, Jarlin Garcia, Dylan Peters and Richards, were all men of mystery to the Dodgers. Only Peters had started a big league game before this month. But the trio allowed only two runs on nine hits in 16 innings while striking out 21. I think that's some of it, Roberts said of facing a staff with so many unfamiliar faces and so little history. But I know our guys aren't going to use that as an excuse. Not as an excuse, just one more thing to stick in their craw after this series. I think when it comes to that first pitcher versus hitter matchup, the pitcher has the advantage. Bullinger said, But we're better than that, obviously. Undrafted out of Drury University, that's in Springfield, Missouri, Richards had been a grizzly, a muck dog and a grasshopper in a professional career that started in an independent league three years ago. Pitched beyond his pedigree Wednesday, mixing a low 90s fastball with a changeup that had the Dodgers flailing away unsuccessfully. He retired 13 of the first 15 Dodgers, walking Yusmani Grandel in the first inning on giving up a single to Kershaw in the third while striking out nine. He made a 10 strikeouts before walking two batters in the fifth inning and touching the magic 100 pitches. That's when Marlins manager Don Mattingly spoiled the narrative, pulling Richards from the game one out before he became eligible for his first Major League win. So Miranda Gonzalez picked up his first instead. The right-handed reliever followed Richards, keeping the Dodgers in check for three innings, matching his previous Major League experience. Richards, the kid threw well. Roberts said, We really couldn't figure him out. Until that last inning, the bats were really silent and up until that point, I think we scored five runs in the series. I don't have an answer for it. I really don't. While Richards strolled through the Dodgers lineup, Kershaw ducked and dodged trouble for five innings, racking up walks like the first-timer. Kershaw walked just three batters in 33 innings over his first five starts this season. He doubled that by the end of the third inning and matched his career high, most recently done in April 2010, with six walks in the game. He twice walked back-to-back -back batters with two outs in an inning. Twice the Marlins loaded the bases but Kershaw wriggled away with no damage and had his own shutout going through four innings. The high wire act required 85 pitches though. 
His day of living dangerously reached an inevitable cliff in the fifth after he walked back-to-back -back batters for the second time. Miguel Rojas made him pay, jumping on a first-pitch fastball, Kershaw's 106th pitch of the game, and lining it high off the foul pole in left field for a three-run home run. I just wasn't very good. Kershaw said, a lot of guys on base. Almost skated out of it. I probably should have given up more than that. Not a great game, for sure. The Marlins padded their lead with two home runs from JT. Romuto later in the game and the Dodgers gifted them two more in the ninth thanks to throwing errors by Corey Seager and Chase Utley and a slip and fell single when Seager tumbled to the ground while pursuing a simple pop-up. That put it out of reach when the Dodgers' offense came to life with a two-out RBI single by Jock Peterson in the sixth and two run home runs by Matt Kemp in the eighth and Yasmani Grandel in the ninth. Dave Roberts